Oh, <laughs> Spike. Sorry, I left the uh, the message on screen as a reminder of myself this time. So I'll be starting in a few minutes. I'm just like cutting a drink together and stuff. I'm double checking I set up all the stream element stuff funny. Or properly, I should say. Hey, it works. Gazi. Yeah, the name of the town is Chlamvaya Po Quingi Hogeru Bindrobo Chlamtasilio Gogogok. So I am just grabbing a drink before I actually start. We good to go. Ta -da. Time to get my ass handed to me by uh, a seer or some friends. Because I am at pretty much the same point that Muffle was at. <gasps> Hi, Bwindon. Real beef curtains, that's who we need. Right, we were in Firelink, we were getting spells. What was I actually looking for? I've got firebombs and shit. Let's redo these spells first. No, no, they're alright. Back to Lothric Castle we go. Or can I spend some of these souls first? Is there anything worth spending it on? Nothing there. Ha 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 chat. Chat, look look at the left bottom of the screen. I was banned for exactly one minute. I call that a lack of spine hair hair. <laughs> It's because I'm too nice to you, Spike. That's what it is. Back again. Right. Um, tell you what, we will just buy out some more of these, shall we? Not going to use Twisted Wall. We'll get Magic Shield, Magic Weapon, Soul Great Sword, Great Farron Dart, Dart. Promise to stay safe. <laughs> beep, 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 beep. Right. Back to Drank Lake Castle, I think. Yeah, I am still stuck at Drank Lake Castle on uh Where am I going? Yeah, I'm still there. Yeah, on my soul level 1 run, I'm still stuck on down, sir. 
Like, you have to do it perfect because she one-shots you and I just can't do it. But I think I've got a way to do a Cirrus. Because I was watching Muffle fight him earlier and I've got an idea. It just depends how much magic resist the guy actually has. Oops. Oops. Right. I need to remember how to fight these guys while fat rolling. Yeah. Also, it's I noticed Greg has been setting up a poll for who's the boss. So, Greg, Manu. Cal and Ludo are the choices. I also put in a comment where Brynden was to vote for. But he also forgot you. Trouble. Beat Greg up before <sighs> Christmas PLS. I voted for Manu because we, we all know Manu is the real boss. Regardless of what else is going on. But yeah, I said he should put a... Uh, let an other option in it, but he said we'd end up with too many, like, too many options. In Homing Slow Mass, need the crystal version. Stop that. Should have asked him to put Spike as an option. It's like Greg, you only do things when Spike forces you to. He got rid of Spike. He got rid of TTS. <gasps> we need more lumber. So he got rid of Spike. Uh, but got rid of Spike. Got rid of TTS because Spike made him. Got rid of. Put a call down on Show Mumble because Spike and the rest of us made him. It is obvious that Spike is the true hidden boss. Keep forgetting that I can buff my staff. That's this one guy. Is almost me, Lord. You must construct additional pylons. You know, there was only one RTS game that I actually played a shit ton of. I had Command and Conquer on the PlayStation, of all things. I had Warcraft 3 that I played loads of with my mates. Set up the trebuchet. 
Here comes the cow. But yeah, there was one for the PC called Submarine Titan. I played that RTS more than any other one that I owned. It was that and June 2000 were the two that I played the most of. But Submarine Titans was great because it was the first one that had, or well, the first one that I played that had proper 3D combat. Because it was underwater, your submarines could go up and down as well as around the map. It was crazy. Like I could do stuff like get small, fast submarines, get them to like as high as possible on the map, so like to the lowest depth, and then just zoom over to the enemy's base and drop them all down at the same time. Right, so now we've got Puss of Man down here. I'm sure I've explored most of this. It's over to the elevator bit I need to get to, isn't it? He went straight under the one place I didn't want him to go. What about this? Yeah, yeah Submarine Titans was a great game. I might play um, June 2000 on stream at some point again as well. Because it's got an actual fan update that added patched a load of stuff like re-added in cutscenes they got rid of and things like that not which way did I need to go was it this way down here but yeah the game had loads of like actual live action cutscenes the same way that Command and Conquer did them yes it was this day we got that guy over there and we need to go up through there to get the shortcut. So we've got you. No taxes are good taxes. <clears throat> That's my motto. Sniped. Okay, that didn't work. Oh, you can see his little red eyes. It's the deep corruption on them. <laughs> I've done that a few times before, Gazi. I've got a couple of different sound setups. And I have to manually switch them if I forget. And just sit there going, why can't I hear Discord? Or why can't I hear any videos playing? Pikeman, forward. Head in there now. Right, so we've Walk got... Walk with pride. These arseholes up here, I think. <laughs> A bit late for you. Or early. I literally finished work like just under an hour ago. Oh, it's these little assholes. Screw you. And where there's one, there's always more. Come on, lock up to him. There we go. You buffing people, you dickhead. Ah, one behind me. 
<laughs> Just general tiredness, you're fine. I'm still trying to get my right arm to work properly. I, I went for my uh, flu vaccination yesterday and my arm has just ached all day long. Oh, you were healing yourself. That's what you were doing. Too bad I've got spells. Right, any more little sneaky bastards? No, so there's three of them. Two spellcasters, and then we're at the door. Good. And a chunk. We actually needed a chunk. <gasps> yeah, Brendan. I, uh, I shuffled around the emotes a bit, so there was like no real duplicates or anything. And yeah, that's all Manu's work. She drew my uh, my PNG, she drew that little emote, she drew a bunch of others as well. And I might have to pay her to make some more soon. Right, Court Sorcerer's Staff. Blah, 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 blah. Yeah. It was called that because that's what Manu was saying in like when we were uploading it. We were trying to come up with a name for it in Discord and Manu kept going blah 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 blah. So that's what it's called. Right, um Blay 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 Oh yeah, with um, moving over to stream elements, I've had a, a bunch more stuff, like for you guys to like mess around with. So I've got new alerts and everything set up. I have the new version of the emote wall that works. Uh, so if I do this. Triggers that. And if I go that one, there's the list of commands for you. So I've added the, the general, general stuff like the account age and things like that. Um, we do have song requests as well with Stream Elements that works through Stream Elements. And then I'll be adding more and more as I get used to the um, format for it and read my way through the documentation. Yeah, Kappa Gen's, uh I'll change it to VIPs. I think I can change it to VIP. Where are you at? There's a level. There you go. Try it now, Spike. But yeah, I've added hug and things like that. And I'll be adding more as I get used to the the notation and stuff for it. So the more I get used to the notation, the, the funkier stuff I can do with it.
Why am I not able to target you? Was it just because you're non-hostile and so cast? It does, but it has a cooldown of it. <gasps> Hi, Brina. How are you? There we go. I did like a community goal thing, Brina. Where I said I would be a VTuber for December if they met it. And it did not take very long for it to go through. So I am the little bear now. Where's the other guy gone? Where are you? Oi. Oi. Oh, you're there in the corner. Little shit. Yeah, I don't think watch time works very well. It is based off stream elements internal thing. And it just likes to throw out zip. <gasps> I'm being summoned to help somebody. Yeah, I need to play around with watch time a bit to get it to work properly. I might do some song requests next week, because I have next week off work. Oh, they're actually in the arena. I had Are zero checks dueling? while waiting trouble. What a surprise. don't think he's dueling, he's just coming after me. Oh, he is dueling. Oh, well then, we got summoned into a fight club. Let's go. This is going to be fun, doing... Fat rolling PvP. No surprising. Oh, he's going to kill me with punches. Oh, well. It's supposed to say how many seconds you've been watching the stream or how many minutes and hours. I did, Brina. It looks really good. I want to... I will be getting it. It will be on my list of stuff to buy. It will be on Dave's as well, most likely. Do I still have the Space Marine voice enabled? I think I do. Give me a... Yeah, no, Brina, because I was setting it up. But yeah, I do have a robe of our voices as well. <laughs> yeah, I was going to get set up a bunch of stuff like... Oh, I don't have the Space Marine on there yet. Hey, was that an exit? It was, and it was a secret shortcut exit, wasn't it? 
Yeah, I need to play around with it for a bit to make it actually sound like a space marine. But I have plans for when I get around to playing Space Marine 2 and maybe a couple of other similar games. No, no buffs, no healing. Not allowed. Right, we've got these knights here, but fuck fighting these guys. We're going to do a dash to our buddy Osiris, or try to. Quick, fight the baby man. And now we have one of the cool bosses. I quite like this one. Yeah, another guy who screwed himself up by messing with dragon stuff. Ah, you ignorant slaves. Finally taken notice, have you? So I might need to swap spells around a bit for this guy, but Child of dragons. I have an idea. And yeah, originally he did have his kid in his arms during this bit. Yeah, you see the way he's cradling his arms, Brina. In the original version of the game, he had his kid in that hand and then killed it as you went into phase two, but they removed it because they thought, nah, that's a bit too far. So. Which is great heavy do. How big is your magic? Oh, you've got a lot of magic resist. And you do a lot of damage as well. I bet a soul spear. Soul spear slightly better. Where have you gone? Are you hiding from me? Come out. Come out. Don't be afraid. You were born a child of dragons. Yeah, when, I, when he goes into phase 2, watch what he does with his hands. And originally he had a baby in those hands when he did it. Now he angry. Right. Got an idea. I'm going to go and get my mist spell back. That's going to come in handy. So. You. He is an optional boss, but I'm doing all bosses, Brina. So. I'm going to have to it's do Santa it. Claus. And his elf. We're not gonna hurt you. No, no. Got some nice presents for you. Be a good little fella now and open the door. Ah! Hi, Dave. I am robot trouble. Play, 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 play. Play, 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 play. play. Yeah, so those dudes just cast spells, and I've just remembered that the lift is at the bottom. Oh no, it's not. Cool. So, Pestilent Mist has been our champion for a couple of bosses. Let's see how Cirrus does against that one. Go away. Sounds familiar, Brendan. Was it? Oh, 
There you go, that's much more like it. Look, he casts it as well. This one might be a dodging competition. Wait, what the actual fuck? I have a deja vu. Isn't this the part Muffo did? Yeah, this is where Muffo was at. I'll be trying to do those same bosses. Emphasis on the trying. Expecting the charge, then. Timing's all off. to get more crystal soul spear casts in or soul spear casts in I should say so take these off the bar first It's the wrong way. Almost had him though. Almost. Yeah, Spike, it only works like one at once. It's got uh, it does have a cooldown on it. Yeah, it's just the way it works. It's like inbuilt that you can't spam it unfortunately. Like he's following me and yes I did leave it at the bottom this time. Come on, jump in the hole. Jump in the hole. Jump in the hole. Landed on me, the little shit. 
No. Little bastard. Spike, you get paid in love. That's all you're getting. Yes, yes. Right. Uh... <clears throat> Shut up, Dave. You've not even finished Blood Warren. Past these guys. Wee. Little shit. Oh, I'm going to have to wait for the elevator again. case of a slip mist and then spam soul spears as long as I can keep him in or around the mist also Timing went completely wonky for the second phase then. Okay, let's go. Why don't you pick a category? I'll take Latitz now for 800. <laughs> Let's go. Dash a dance of Franz of Vixen, come and cue me down of this. Dash a dance of Franz of Vixen, come and cue me down of this. I'm having a good time. Bye. <laughs> Bye. I have to watch that again soon. Shortcut. Now we run. I did watch Predator again the other day. Does that count? That's got Arnie in it. So. 
Wrong timing again. Um, I don't think it's on Netflix at the moment, Spike, but they have been adding a load of Christmas movies and stuff lately. So it might be. Right, I'm sure one of these rings is wrong. Length of spell. No. Yeah, I did have it right. Um, spellcasting time, boost sorceries. Yeah, I was just looking to see if I had anything that would, uh... <laughs> yeah, I was saying I, uh... I watched Predator the other day. Does that count, Spike? I was also make checking to make sure I had the ring on that extends the, uh... The length of the spell. It is not on our lawn door, unfortunately, Alex. Ah, he fell off. <gasps> this is, in fact, anal radio. Gash resistance ring. Can't believe it's called that in Demon Souls. Yeah, Brina is hiding away down there. He even said hello earlier. <gasps> Saw the picture of your hair, by the way, Alex. It looks cool. place to stop. So was that. Mr. Trouble, I miss Lenny, dear Lenny, also how can you not win this when watching Muffo fail life? Well, 69,420 times. Because Muffo was allowed to dodge properly. 
getting closer, though. <gasps> you play more Tarkov, Alex. Killing noobs. There you go, Brina. I added you back as a VIP. My channel does not need much modding, so I've just left it. So you can abuse commands and stuff now if you want to. Uh, should be thieves. Stop following me. Or at least jump down the hole so I don't have to deal with you. You know what? Fuck you, you little bastard. Still need to try and get pestilent mist off in the second part of this. <laughs> nah, Dave, you'll probably just ban yourself somehow. It's more likely. So, yeah. Second stage of this boss, I do still need to cast pestilent mist. Because he is still staying still a bit, so it's worth it for the extra damage. It's just getting the cast off that's the problem. Let's go! to talk was it I thought he was going to cast something then but apparently not late how are you Manu are you still studying mm -hmm. 
<laughs> hey, the timer still works. I must have missed it earlier. We are at the boss, Manu. And I am slowly getting there. Slowly. And Spike has found a new toy. Okay, people, tomorrow morning, 10 a.m., Santa's coming to town. Santa! Oh my god! <laughs> he falls down again. I'm having a good time. Bye. <laughs> Little shit's inside the lift. And away we go. <laughs> yeah, you can trigger like a little emote flood with Kappa Gen. But it does have a cooldown on it and stuff. Oop. Oop. Yeah, mine got past. About here. Gundia. We've got um, Dragon Armor or Dragon Slayer Armor. We've got Oof. we got the rest of Cathal Lothric. At that point, I could then just go and do. Soul of Cinder, but I want to do the DLC as well. Um, Ariandel has two, technically three bosses, and Ring City has three bosses, if I remember correctly. But the end boss of Ariandel and the end boss of Ring City could take me quite a while, because they are tough. But I do get a couple of fancy new spells for my trouble. Which might actually help a lot with those. <gasps> well, Valhalla. You know, I've not really played any Assassin's Creed since... Origins. Like, as much as I like RPG games and stuff, I didn't like the RPG element they put into Assassin's Creed. Like the whole leveling and stuff like that. <gasps> but yeah, uh, Origins and Valhalla both look really good. It's just I got bored of Origins very quickly. Don't be afraid. You were 
born a child of dragons. What could you possibly fear? No. No. Show me yourself, Barcelona. All right, so this attempt isn't going very well at the moment. Get another one off. No, he was right on top of me. That breath I need to avoid badly. Odyssey, that was the one I was trying to remember the name of. But yeah, I'm tempted to try Valhalla out at some point. <clears throat> Imagine getting stuck in a drinking game, Spike. Yeah, I will probably go back and finish Origins at some point. I do still own it. It's just I'm about... I got about halfway through it and just ran out of drive to play it. Now we all know how bad you are at game Spike. We know you were just stuck. <laughs> Both of them fell. Oops. Oh, no, no, no. This is what I was going to do anyway. So I could have the lift ready for next time. If there is a next time. Help step trouble him stuck, you woo. Oh, poor Spike. Unfortunately, I can't help if you're stuck. I can only fix your pipes. This friendly little cloud I've left yet. Come out. Come out. Don't be afraid. Help step trouble. I have no money while watching the streams. Do you know a way to solve this problem just between us two? You'll just have to pour yourself out on OnlyFans. Entire combo then.
Wait a second, chat just died. Ah, oh, no, it's fine. It was just being weird. Right. Away we go. I am laying on the ground. What are you talking about me being dead? <laughs> well, there's... Which emote is it? Switch. This emote... There's actually a ton of stuff you can just avoid with that emote because of how low down it is. Oh, no worries, Gazzy. I shall see you in a bit. Like, there's like an intro bit to the Ring City. Where you get to the city itself. And there's a lot of enemies. You can actually just avoid using that emote. Or you can avoid them hitting you. And I will try and show it off if I get the chance. Because I've still got... Got this. And Bloodborne. To do. So I'll be doing to Bloodborne after I finish Dark Souls 3. And I won't be streaming Elden Ring straight away because can everybody will. So I'm gonna do my like my first playthrough off stream and then let you guys choose a challenge for me for my second Elden Ring playthrough. I will keep throwing cows with Ma Trebuchet over your castle wall until you give us our jester of the king back. <laughs> with my trebuchet. For the longest time I thought it was pronounced Tree Bucket. <laughs> tree Bucket. Ah, he got me again. So what I'll do, I'll do a few more attempts at this boss. If not, I will progress through the castle a bit more. And we will come back and fight him some more later. Because he is an optional boss, so I can always leave him until I've leveled a bit more and stuff if I need to. Do 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 this way. Oh, have you seen there's like a a trebuchet meme subreddit? So it pops up on my recommended all the time, and it's just of a. Uh, a lot of history nerds. Lol, trouble, are you kidding me? Look straight into the camera. Yes, your character looks like a clown XD. <sighs> yeah, it's like a meme subreddit, and it's just people saying 
look how much better the trebuchet is than a catapult and things like that. both cast it but mine last lasts longer because and now he's gonna freak out Drop me in it. <laughs> yeah, it is a meme. I don't know, trebuchet is pretty handy. Usually has better range than the catapult, at least. But yeah, it's like uh, the whole thing has memes like. Um, what would win 200 foot stone wall or one swingy boy? Bye. He fell down. I've played it like once or twice. I know somebody who had it, but I never actually owned it myself. I just remember peasants bitching on it all the time. About having not having enough food and shit like that. Trouble the boomer, yes yes. Right, come here, dragon man. I managed to do dodge exactly zero of his attacks then. you up. Oh, <laughs> only played in German. Right, um, what was I gonna do? Yeah, fix those borders. Yeah, I just noticed something going wonky on my monitor thing, so I'm fixing it, because it was annoying me. Where's it gone? Just staring at you, blinking, not saying anything.
There we go. Now it looks proper. It sees you. Could be worse. Could be this one. Man who loves this one. Because his tail blinks at you when you're not least expect it. <laughs> yes, we've got all the fat. I've got a couple of other stupid ones. I have the gnome as well. He is sat here ready. Just looking wonky. And I have... Fake Pepe. This is fake Pepe. Fake Pepe sits here and calls you stupid names. And then, back to this one. I do have another secret one as well, but that's for a later stream. When I get round to it. Yeah, it's the gnome from Gravity Falls, Dave. I found like a... Like a free interpretation somebody had done of it. I was like, oh, I can use this. Hi, late. How are you doing, Bart? Does your head feel cold yet? Now it's got less hair on it. Yeah, Gravity Falls it has got some pretty funny stuff bits in it. to catch it or if I need to cast this to get it's one on one I need to remember what happened there I got stuck Play the oh no, I got stuck in. Uh, stop it. Ah. It's going slowly, Bart. I can drop this guy down to his most aggressive phase, but then he starts being mean. Mm. Right. So, 
please apologize my TTS spam, Alex. I don't have it in me to resist sad cat. Slowly but surely. Oi! That also Why counts for me to sad. I'll take the tits now for 800. <laughs> Hi, Manu. <laughs> um. Brin, Spike, Spike, shut the fuck shut the up. fuck up. That's the way it works. You get told off together. Right. Um. So. Brin, Spike, shut the fuck up. I did completely the wrong thing. And then he dropped his own precedent. Troubled, chat, let's be honest here. Look at the left bottom of the screen. Just ban me already. Missing everything. All of it. Santa Claus! And it's Elf! We're not gonna hurt you! No, no. That's no. nice presents for you. Be a good little fella now and open the door! <laughs> also, Lenny, where are you, my boy? Lenny. Lenny! That was badly timed. Badly timed. No, he still got me. Agazi. I'm still at the same place I was when you left. Um... I'm trying to think if any of these will be useful. Not sure if Young Dragon and Bellowing stack. I don't think they do. <laughs> Trouble, listen up. I have a plan. A plan to get us all out of here. All I need is just some bit of cash. Just a bit of cash. Well, good thing you have your own fancy business now, Spike. You'll be rolling in cash in no time. <laughs> yeah, Muffle's doing much better in Dark Souls 3. He's still... True fact, rolling in cash hurts, paper cups Gweg. and copper edges, yuck. Okay, yeah, okay, he, um, okay, right. Spike, he's the plan. The plan. You shut the, shut fuck, the, up the fuck up and run before you do that, your boy Bryn needs to shut the fuck up first. Ten tenths perfect plan. Yeah, I think one of the main problems Moffat has with damage at the moment is that he's not getting the distance on the scythe. He would do way more damage with it if he managed, managed to keep the actual step or so away you need to be for the scythe to do its full damage. But there's a couple of times where he'd have beat Gundir if he'd have had that damage. Good execution, but first we need some little bit of money for our boy Lenny. Born a 
child of dragons. What could you possibly feel? No. No. I need to stop getting hit by everything. Is my favourite person in chat. <gasps> Bart. Not supposed to add these th ask these things. And it's quite obvious like my favourite person in chat is Troublebot. <laughs> Troublebot is the MVP. Uh, Miyazaki takes all the drugs and then reads a couple of tra chapters of uh, Berserk and then takes more drugs and writes some soul stuff. It's the way it works. I do have marketing emails turned on for Troublebot as well, so I'll see if his Twitch recap comes through. <laughs> My favourite yeah. person in chat is Manu, because Manu yes, is the boss. Someone is going to clip it. Yes, yes. My second person in chat is Brian, who works the hardest out of us spouting the absolute nonsense we tell him to all day. Uh, uh, uh. anyway. shit.
Ah. Hyper. Um, I don't think so. I think it's mainly physical, Brendan. So I'm not sure how useful it will be. I could try it. No reason not to. Pretty much a shield. Yeah, I am currently dying to this boss. What I'll do is I'll make this the last attempt for now. Yeah, good point, actually. Yeah, I'll make this the last attempt for now. And then... If I, uh... Fail again, I shall head through the other part of the castle. Because I could always go and get some more levels and stuff and come back to him later. Up, you want robo trouble. If you want this one, is it Brendan? And this is weird. <laughs> Hi, Bart. Yeah, there is a way for you guys to control that, but it only works with bits at the moment, and I want it to work for channel points. If I can get it to work for channel points, I'll put it on so you guys can change my voice. Ow. Yeah, I fucked that up. Great, we'll go the other way through the castle. See what we can find. Brendan Seven cheered Dex Ten. Robo voice, yes, yes, Mr. Destructoid. <gasps> Robo voice, yes, yes. All right, I'll do it for a bit. Robo voices, it is. So, sort these spells out first. Great Heavy, Soul Mass, Spear, Flash Sword. So I will leave it on for a little bit for you, Brendan. Brendan, Spike, shut the fuck up. <laughs> right, you, Caster Woman. You could die first. No, I can set it up to do the robot voice. Oh, he's a red eye. I just realized. Super, super aggressive man. Yeah. For the Emperor. Exterminate. <laughs> A bunch of others on there as well. There's like an evil voice. It's the evil one, like. There's this one. Sounds a bit demonic. Just a little bit demonic. Oh, 
motherfuckers, come on. Come on, motherfuckers, come on. Right. Um. Fuck you, red eyes. There we go. Red eyes is gone. Done with. All over Crestfall at night. Oh, he dropped something. Ah! <gasps> so, Brendan, if you have not heard, there is a little town in Wales. It has a very special name. Okay, I will do it robot voice just this dance. And the name of the town is. Clamvaya po huingi kogeru huidrobo klantasilio kogogoch. There you go, Bryn. Right. Where are the others? I see a big knight. Got him. You just sounded like dial up then, lol. <gasps> like a dial up. That better not be a revive spell. Good, it's not. It is just a buff. You buffed him, didn't you, you shit? Yep. You are not lunging me with that move. Is he going? Oh, is it the edge of your bound or something? It is, it's the edge of his bounds, that's why he can't come in here. Oh well. Looks to be that guy. Yeah, handiness of soul spear, it's a piercing spell. So it does go out the other side of it. And I got his sword. Oh! <gasps> I have to listen to that, see how it sounds, because I can't hear the rub of it. That's pretty cool. Yeah, I can preview the uh, the voices myself, but when it's actually using it, I can't hear it. But yeah, I will set up the points thing later. Or the bits thing. I will try and make it work for points if I can, but if not, well, tough. We have bonfire. Right. What's this? Don't you dare, only pointless ahead. Really? Pointless ahead. Oh, it drops down to the other area, that's all it is. No mind. So yeah, we can get this bonfire to Aceros if we just go over there.
You're not a mimic because the chain is the wrong way. Around. A well, a bird, bird, be bird is the word a well. A bird, 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 be bird's the word a well. A bird, bird, Liar. bird, well a bird is the word a well. A bird, bird, be Poor. bird's the word a well a don't you know about the bird? Well, everybody knows that the bird is the word. <sighs> Spike. Not everybody knows that the bird is the word. Favourite Christmas movie? Mine is Scrooged. I have loved that film since I was a little boy. I should have probably sat at that bonfire, to be honest. <laughs> I'm having a good time, bye! <laughs> These guys. Yeah, I saw it once when I was little. I was like, oh, that film's amazing. Ha, ha, ha. I am having a good time. Bye. <gasps> I'm having a good time. Bye. Bop. Just bop you with my staff. Is this the one where they climb over the edge? Yeah, it is. Get down. The Muppet one's pretty good. Um, this is the angel room, isn't it? I see you up there. Come on, jump down. Casts. Time to bop him. If I can even hit him. Oh wow, look at all that damage. See what? Boop, 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 boop. Go this way. Oh yeah, Gremlins is great. Although I never got to see it often because my sister was terrified of it. <gasps> Actual good notes. Yeah, it was one of like, there are a few films my sister saw when she was way too young to. Um, like Gremlins was originally going to be like an 18 plus. Shield are you? Oh, it's the spell parry shield. Cool. Um, yeah, Gremlins was one of them. She must have been like seven or eight when she saw Gremlins, and it terrified her. This would be really good if I had casts left. We'll get back to the bonfire then. Uh, yeah, Gizmo was cute. I do have a gizmo somewhere, I don't know where it is. It was in one of one one of the many boxes when we moved house and I don't know where it's gone. But yeah, there are a couple of films when we were little that my sister saw when she really shouldn't have. So she like she can't stand gremlins. She just won't watch it. Um What else was there? There was... Oh yeah, she uh... 
when we first got like TVs like personal TVs of our own we got like dirt cheap ones I think we were second hand off my uncle or something and we put uh, we had a TV each in our room we loved it it was like the lap of luxury my sister fell asleep once close to Halloween and she woke up and she was like couldn't get back to sleep so she was like oh I'll put the telly on for some background music or background noise I should say and uh it was when BBC in the UK used to saw used to show films later on at night so Kelly woke up and went, oh, I'll watch a film, like, help me get back to sleep. And BBC said, oh yeah, up next on BBC is Candyman. And Kelly was like, oh yeah, that sounds like a kid's film, I'll watch that, It'd be great. Cue, like, 15 minutes later and my sister screaming the house down. My mum running upstairs to see what was wrong with her. No, she just accidentally watched Candyman when she was like eight, nine years old, something like that. Omen was great though. I loved Omen when I first saw it. Dave was scared of tremors because Dave's rubbish. Alex watched Exorcist. Nah, I never did Alex because I would have got my ass beat by my dad most likely. Who said you could, you, you could be using these fancy miracles? Ow, he just clapped me out of existence. Hey Dave, imagine being scared of a Kevin Bacon film. <laughs> candy man, candy man, candy man, candy man. Ready? Wait for it. I'm going to say chat, cunty man. <laughs> cunty man. <laughs> right, get this one. I think I've actually got enough for a level up there. I do. Right. Um. Also, as men, I think we should all be scared of Kevin Bacon. <laughs> oh, ah, the Blob was a great movie. I got bought. A couple of years back, my mum and my sister both bought me a cheesy, like, sci-fi B-movies box set. One, two, tremors coming for you. Three, four, better lock your door. Welcome. 
But uh, the first two films that were in the box set of cheesy sci-fi stuff were The Blob and The Stuff. They were both great. Right, back to Lothric Castle. Make some actual progress. Bum, 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 bum. <gasps> the stuff. Yeah, the stuff was a great one. It's like, oh yeah, we've uh this company goes, oh yeah, we've found this like low fat natural alternative to ice cream. We're gonna call it the stuff. And then it turns out to be like an alien organ uh organism from space that they've just been harvesting. And it works like a hive mind, so everybody who's been eating it gets basically mind controlled. Kind of like body catcher style. Yeah, when I played, um, What was it called? Space Station 13. When it helps write stuff for that game. We used to do horror movie nights with the um, people developing and coding and stuff for it. So I'd be there testing shit because I only ever did testing and map design because my coding knowledge is shit. Ban but, me again, um, mister. We would sit there sometimes and I'd just be testing stuff over and over for them. Oi, you. Throwing hunter charms. More of them. And I can't heal. Run away! Dead. <gasps> Manu! But yeah, we used to do horror nights. So we'd be sit there, um, we'd be sat there testing stuff over and over. They'd do an update, commit it, we'd test it again. And all in the meantime, we'd be watching like our way through all the Omen films and things like that. That was when I discovered, like, the third Halloween movie has nothing to do with any of the rest of them. It's like, oh yeah, we'll watch Halloween, Halloween's cool. So I watched the first one, watched the second one. And then the third one has this weird cult and stuff in it. But yeah, if any of you, case any of you ever have the urge to watch the Skewt series, you can just skip the third one doesn't even have anything to do with uh, Michael Myers. Killer clowns from outer space. Yeah. Killer clowns from outer space is great. If you want to see the comedy version of it, Bryn. There's a comedy version of it called Earth Girls Are Easy. And it's basically the same concept, but they just hunt for women instead. And they're terrible at it. Yeah, that's the one I'm talking about, Bryn. Um... It was... Bloody Hunter Charms. 
part three was called uh, Season of the Witch. Oh, it's you up there, you little shit. Oh yeah, they're supposed to look horrible. Ooh. Oh, I can't even use Ashen like this. Shit. Gotta wait for it to wear off. Come on, should be hunting charms. Uh... Yeah, the first child's play is like is more of a horror film than anything else but even then it's like cheesy horror film but all the rest of them since then like the second one and bride of and spawn of chucky and all that are all supposed to be goofy like goofy silly ones the new one, Bryn. I can never remember which one is which. Oh, there was another guy. <laughs> well, I know the new one has a a great ending that calls back to the original films, specifically to the very first film. Need more casts. That guy with the jeweler's charms is real. I think they're can never remember whether they're jeweler's charms or hunter charms, but they're really annoying. Hey look, you can see messages from the persistent world. And you can see how the world doesn't actually match up. Because there's messages in impossible places. Yay. Oh look, there's one of the butterflies as well. These guys are fly flying all over this area. Yeah, if you've not seen the most recent one yet, Bryn, it is worth seeing. It's pretty good. You're not a person. The wood spider is the most accomplished of all web building species. Recently, <sighs> scientists gave these tiny creatures a variety of psychoactive drugs to observe their effect on web building. When oh, given the minute spider dose video. of LSD, the spider's web took on an unfamiliar minimal structure. When given caffeine, the web structure was not affected, but the spider's behavior was. Yeah, I know exactly which video this given talks THC, about. THC, the active ingredient in marijuana, the spider didn't build a web. It built a hammock, where it lay all day and watched the caffeine spider go. <laughs> when given alcohol, the spider built a web, found a mate and raised over a hundred young. But the mate got a restraining order, and now the spider can't go within a hundred centimeters of the web. The crack <clears throat> cocaine spider figured building webs was for suckers, waited till the caffeine spider was exhausted then came up behind it and popped a... <laughs> a cap in its ass. Nice web, Mr. Crack Spider. When winter came, the marijuana spider had no place to live. It ended up in the crack web as the crack spider's bitch. 
For more information on the crack spider's bitch, contact the Canadian Wildlife Service in Ottawa. Yeah, we did the same, Bryn. We'd always record stuff like that. And then... Oh, did I leave me all quality will one. degrade constantly because it um the more you recorded over it the worse the quality got dealt with. Ooh, I'll get your gauntlets. Right. Um, where were we going? Yeah, if you ever actually get to watch the actual spider on drugs video, Spike, you should watch it. I'm pretty sure it's on YouTube. It is like one of the dumbest experiments done. Because they're like, oh yeah, we're going to feed this the spider like a, a minute dose of LSD. I was like, no. It's a minute dose for a human. It's like drinking a bucket of LSD for a spider. <gasps> Dagrons! <laughs> so... We need to go down there. Quick go. Made it. Another chunk. There are zombie men's down there. I know there are. What we need. Some of these. Way. We'll go the drop down route first because I can't remember what go what is in which direction. No transform for you. <laughs> yeah, that spider becomes Rom. Like the first old one boss that you fight in Bloodborne. That's why he's called Rom the Spider, or Rom the Vacuous Spider. Whoa! Stay in casting range, you little shit. Never mind, he disappeared. But I killed the sneaky one. I can hear breathing. That's why I can hear breathing. Uh. Joe Rogan is such a dumbass. But I know loads of people who might listen to his podcasts and stuff, but the guy's a fucking idiot. Like, he could talk about MMA all day long. And he knows a shit ton about that. But Anything beyond that, he's thick as fuck. 
Why do I hear Stompy? Oh, another Angel Knight. I skip you. What's over here? Oh, this is where this dickhead is. Piss off. Oh, no. Yeah, the armor's empty. Right, I gotta skip my way past all these. Do a runner. Run like a bitch. Right, um, so we go. Up. Over the edge. Kill this nerd. Ban me like him some sort of. <gasps> hey look, it picked out the band word. Boys, boik. Me, a little dickhead. Right, I'm sure that thing ex exists purely as a trap. Whoever did that, you have no spine. Keep the ban on you, wuzzy pussy bitch boy. Bottom corner. It is Spike's fault. I remember before, everything that Spike does, you get punished for as well. So yeah, you'll have to take up your grievance with Spike. Who spams together gets spammed together. Bad boys for life. For life. Run! I didn't even see what I picked up then. Uh, so we got some lightning urns. More souls. Bad boys, bad boys. What you gonna do? What you gonna do when the mods have no spine and ban you and get scared and unban you in like three seconds? Is it this time? Pew 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 
You go, Spike. Anyway, I can turn this little bug around. Is he even here? Is he gone? He's gone, bugger it. Run! You seriously are wuzzy pussy bitch boy and or girls. I ask for ban, I get unbanned in three seconds. I ask for ban again I get a timeout which is actually not even a ban but I get a timeout for 3000 seconds and get untimed <laughs> yeah. out within 120 seconds. Trouble you need mods who rule with an iron fist. I'm sorry Brendan. It is the rule. <laughs> I will just leave it until the bards get bored and unban you. I think it does pop up with something if they do. I can't remember. Right, there are treasures. What's this way? This way we've got multiple knights. Ah, oh, a couple more at once, that's fine. Guys, come on, I'm disappointed. There. Ooh, I got his sword as well. Bonk. Ah, uh, nothing over here. That was just to get that great sword, I think. Right, uh, what's in the castle. Yeah, I remember reading some of the unban requests.
trouble, your mods need to learn to rule with an iron fist, I'm kinda training them but how do I reach these skis? What's this? Oh fuck you! Lotheric Knight from nowhere. Not Lotheric Knight, Roaming Knight, or whatever they're called. One of Pontiff's crew. Yeah. <laughs> okay mods, I suggest ban Brynden, that hurts me lots more than it hurts you so in that way you punish me anyway right? Right, uh, this way. No other guy down there. Right, um, meh, 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 meh. So I do need to take out this nerd. And then this one. Got him. Now there is the axe man. Stand together united. United you stand and united you fall. The way it works. Right, uh, so. We need to be a boy damage for this. I also need to not get hit. Bum, 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 bum.
There, got you. Is you done? There we have Axeman. If I even aim in the right direction. Didn't mean to fall down here, but bugger it. We're gonna do a run. See if it can follow us. See if they'll fight each other, actually. It's a possibility. It's unlikely, but... I do quite like the thing. I did think it were kind of funny as well, like the entire film can get spoiled if you uh, speak Norwegian as well. Irithyll Rapier. Right, I can ignore you, can I? Because I'm going this way. <laughs> yeah, like the opening of the film where the dog's running around. Like they're shouting in Norwegian, so if you can speak Norwegian, the entire film will get spoiled. Or at least that part of it does. And there was... <gasps> chest. There was something down here. Spirit tree. Which one is the spirit tree? You are. Now the cute mod is gone, can I get banned again? Yes, yes. <sighs> uh, great with the juices, lightning damage. And chest two is a nice scale. Uh, you're curving back, so you're fine. Twinkling Titanite. You're also curving back, so you're fine. Twinkling Titanite. dash to the other side. I cannot remember. I think it is. I think it's just a mad dash to the other side. 
Right, let's go for it. Ooh. Made it. Now to get murdered by everything in this room. Whatever there is. Or is it this just just this Ticadia? There. Dog Tundra, the cheeky bugger. Got him. Right, uh. I see you there. Yeah, the dragons in this look pretty cool. Even though they're not real dragons. Right, check what's up this way. We've got more of them. I see you. Dragon these nuts across your face. Yeah. But they're not real dragons, so it's not as fun. Oi! Dickhead. Gem, magic resin, you're a mimic. Got assassins hiding out here. What's this? Tonight scale. Any secrets? Nope. And then down this way, we have the dragon. Or the bit of the dragon that we can see. Oh yeah, forget about those dudes. We do this. We had the dragon. And that thing is where the dragon has been me. Dragon is dead. I think that one's dead as well, if I remember right. Large Titanite Shard. Out this way. Just lead back down. I 
does. Leads to a shiny. Oh, it still went. Bastard. Oh yeah, the other one's dead as well. Cool. Now we can just loot all the stuff. Need to get in there at some point. Ember. Refined gem. Lightning gun. Bop. Yeah, you can still hear that guy freaking out down there. Um, where do we go from here? So it was up. This. You lad. Out here, which goes down and around. This leads up to the Mimic. And this leads inside. I hear a knight. I'm sure I do. More than one knight. Well, let's open the door. Gate is open. Uh. I do not have enough casts. Run away. Pretty sure the dragons stay dead now, so I'm just gonna run across the bridge. It's got enough for another level as well. This way. Back to Firelink. Get me some levels and shit. I'm going to level up, and I think I'm going to finish there for tonight, because I'm tired, and I'm hungry. Um, level up. 33. I should have enough for this. So we've got... 25, 25, and 25, which is what I wanted. It's now all going into int. Every last bit of it. We are just going to pump that int until we do ridiculous damage. If I wasn't playing the fat roll build, I would normally already have 50 int. Because I always pump, like, whatever stat I'm main using. I tend to pump really early. Just max out as much as I can. So. I don't think we got enough for an upgrade, did we? I think we picked up a couple of chunks, but I don't think we got enough for an actual upgrade. Force. Oh, we did. Now we just need a slab. Be careful. <laughs> Big staff. There is another staff it's going to get replaced with later, but for now, this is Big Staff. And what I am going to do, though, is get rid of that for Mist because 
as good as homing soul masses for like PvP and stuff. I think I need the crystal version for PvE. Was asked me done for today, so we is done there. I'll be streaming again next week. I will post my schedule up on Discord as normal when I work out what I'm going to be doing. I didn't manage to get any bosses done today, Bart. I bashed against a Seros for a bit. So I will go back to a Seros after I've reached like the boss of this area. Who is the Dragon Slayer Armor, I think he's called. And then I might go back to a Seros and carry on that way. But we made some progress at least, made it way a decent chunk of the way through the castle. So keep your eye on Discord. We're gonna go and say hello to Gweggy. He's playing more chess, I think. And I will see all you nerds next time. Bye bye.